I think Mark hit the nail on the head. Even if you're not a die-hard fashionista, Fashion Week attracts such a colourful, creative, crackers crowd that the atmosphere is just fun to be around, Mark, isn't it? You're live now at London Fashion Week for us, but I think the audience is as impressive as the fashion sometimes. It, it absolutely is. I mean, it is. It's, it's an incredible weekend. I just, I, absolutely, I love London Fashion Week. It is absolutely brilliant. Um, the uh, the show is going on downstairs at the moment, and Tony Berardi, they're just sweat and uh, doing sweat and sore. But this is actually part of London Fashion Week that you very rarely get to see. So this is actually the uh, British Fashion Week um, a showroom. So this is where all of the smaller name designers actually get to show their wares and uh, get it in front of, you know, international buyers, also big name fashion editors. Um, so this is where you kind of see all the new talent coming through and basically that's what London Fashion Week is all about. It's about turning creativity into business. Obviously this is brilliant but the catwalk shows have been fantastic as well. With the catwalk shows that means you get some famous faces as well. At Top Chop yesterday I went and caught up with Will I Am and he was bigging up his mate Jennifer Hudson. Well, it's fun. ITV has been great. Yeah and it's, it's awesome to have a person like Jennifer Hudson on the show no. who is um, she's an ex-contestant, yeah. didn't really go all the way, uh -huh. and made an amazing career for yeah. herself, and sings like, you know, Whitney Houston should be proud. I also went and caught up with the Stallone family as well. Now, Sylvester's wife, Jennifer, was there with her daughter, Sophia. They were there to watch their other daughter, Sistine, do her thing on the catwalk at Topshop. Um, I was asking, though, is Sly actually gonna get to watch his daughter strut her stuff? Here's what they had to say. Are we going to be doing FaceTime to your dad? Is that... oh, oh, for sure. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to be watching it live from Los Angeles. Oh, is that how Yeah, he's, he's so excited. This has been her dream since she was a little girl. So this is, she loves every aspect of fashion, Absolutely. from the designers, the hair and makeup. She loves everything. And there was the return of a supermodel, wasn't there? Oh, there was indeed. It was lovely. It was, it was Agnes Dean. Now, if you remember, Agnes Dean, um, he, she was at Henry Holland um, show, and, and uh, Henry Holland and Agnes have been friends since they were kids and have kind of risen to fame together. Her as this, you know, the must-have model, him as this must-have designer kind of thing. Um, and she's actually not been at one of his shows for ages. In fact, I was going through old photos last night, and this, I think, was the last time she was there. That's me and uh, Henry and Agnes, and that was back in 2011 um, that she was there then. So it was so nice to have her sit in the front row to see her friend do his thing. But we're going to be seeing more of her because she is going to be appearing on British television. Is it nice being back in London and seeing Henry and stuff like that? Yeah, I love it. That... I'm actually here till the end of June, so he's going to be sick of oh, me, no, actually. Really? I'm filming here until oh, June. Amazing. So... What are you filming at the moment? Uh, a BBC drama. Oh, uh, that's brilliant. So we're yeah. going to see a lot more of you. Yeah, you are. We've missed you. Mark, thank you very much. Have fun. Please take it off that jacket. It was absolutely brilliant. He I looks will. roasting. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fake. It's the slides to fashion. Look, oh, he's see? a cheeky one. It's a t-shirt right, underneath.